Thank you, President. Uh, through targeting students, schools and education, like it did most recently in Garissa University in Kenya, or attacking UNICEF personnel like last week in Somalia, Ashbabab is literally putting a bomb under the future of the African continent. Needless to say, we can't let this happen. It's totally unacceptable, and I offer my condolences to the families who've lost their loved ones and whose future has been robbed from them. The ramifications of this terrorist organization across several countries and its well-developed system of acquiring financing and its ties with other terrorist groups call for smart, decisive and comprehensive response. And I think this requires supporting and coordinating with the Kenyan government whose belated response to the recent massacre has been lacklustre. Most critically, any strategy we adopt should solve rather than contribute the divisions this group is trying to sow. And I think very importantly that I believe whenever one group is persecuted, the entire society suffer. And let's not forget in Kenya, counter-terrorism activities have marginalized and stigmatized Muslim communities as well as Christians. So my message to the Commission, the High Representative and the Kenyan government is that we need a strategy that brings security for all, regardless of their background Thank you. or their religion. Thank you. Thank you very much. Next speaker for one minute, Franz Obermeier. Thank you, Herr Präsident.